I'm a multifunctional contemporary everyday mompreneur. I'm the CEO and founder of JacheEssentials.com where I create and make all natural hair and body products. I'm also a licensed cosmetologist and also a licensed educator. And I am a lifestyle scoper here on Periscope. And um, we just, we basically talk about how we can be, continue to be authentically us, right? With no regrets. So welcome sisters, welcome everybody. Thank you so much. Welcome everybody. Um, so, hi Sally, hey sister. I am, as you can see, I'm extremely tired. I've been working. Thank you so much. Thank you. So we could just... Yeah, you guys can start right now. Okay. Yeah, can go get your food if y'all want. Okay. So let me show you guys where... Um, where I'm gonna call you guys. We're at Pizza okay, Hut, so, everybody. So, um... We are at Pizza Hut right now, guys. This is my first time dining in at Pizza Hut. I've never um, dined in at Pizza Hut before. And, um, oh, my arm is killing me. We have never dined in at Pizza Hut before. This is my first time here. And um, um, my son had an appointment this morning. I took him to go get his blood work this morning, took care of that this morning. So a lot of things got accomplished this morning. I just was having, like, a really, um, thank you, sister. I was really having, like, a really, um, um, hard time yesterday this way you hadn't seen me on last night I was really having a rough night and um, this morning is that all you want you don't want more you sure okay, okay you can sit over here okay you can sit in your booth let you in so she can sit guys yes. so she can eat so all she can right. eat so um put this over here so is that business? Let me get my food too. Yeah. Sit down. Okay. Hi, sisters. How y'all doing? Look, so at the buffet, the Pizza Hut buffet, this is my first time. I've never had a Pizza Hut buffet before, and I'm excited. Look at these little cute little slices of pizza. Hi, April. Hi, sister. How are you? Before I start taking all these, let me just get a piece of everything yeah you saw that right sis you saw that right hmm. so um, we are eating pizza on today that's what we're doing on today we're gonna eat some pizza um, you've never had pizza hut Teresa are you for real right now you've never had pizza Girl, I love Mr. Pizza Hut. I've never had these other kinds of pieces, but I just want to try it. You welcome. We're just doing a quick one. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Can you believe it? Well, can you believe I'm actually eating on today? Um, as you can see, it kind of feels like I even lost my voice also. I am actually eating. Let me tell you what I'm doing today, guys. And I, I have to tell you this, guys, because... Um, not just say for me I'm just gonna say for a lot of us we all work so hard that we don't take enough time out for ourselves okay and I'm guilty of it y'all see some of the ladies and eat properly when I get I do don't it. do that thank you 
Thank you so much. Thank you. I can pay for it now if I want to. I sure will so when I'm ready to go, I can go. I always like to pay for myself up front. <laughs> Look, the buffet was only twenty one dollars. Yo, you know we about to eat, right? You know we about to eat. <laughs> so, as I was saying, hi, how you doing today? Am I going up there somewhere? Oh, cool. Hold on one second. Hi, Ebo. Hi, sisters. Y'all know I'm forcing this smile on my face, right? But y'all not gonna judge me. Thank you so much. Yes, that's neat. So I can't wait for us to go on our trip, sis. I can't wait for us to go on vacation. Do you like it, sister? Let me tell you what I did on my lips. All I used was a regular black liner, lip liner, and put it on. That's all I did. Nothing, um, thank you so much. Ain't nothing uh, flawless about this. My hair is, is, is just basic today. Thank you so much, sweetie. My hair is just whatever today. I'm tired and I just wanted to take some time out after I took care of my, um, so you can kind of say I let my son play hooky today a little bit. Well, he, had, he still has all these appointments anyway, so I said, you know what, let's go out and let's go eat and let's just have some family time. I need to spend some quality time with my kids, just me and my babies. Hi, sister, how are you? I just want to spend some quality time with my kids. Um, take some time out for myself. It <laughs> okay, and um, I I'm tired. I'm I'm tired. I've been a little down lately, and um, I'm going through a lot right now. And um, I'm stopping for a little bit to take some time out for myself. That's what I'm doing. And today's Friday. It's the weekend. Yeah, know I'm gonna be at Perry Union next week. Um, um, on Thursday. I'm sure next week, Wednesday. What? I thought you were leaving on and, Thursday. Um, mm -mm. Next week, Wednesday. And um, I'm preparing myself. Thank you, sis. I'm preparing myself. And I just want to take a break from work. Yeah. I needed that break. I needed that break. I've been working nonstop. And I just want to have a break. So I'm going through it right now. I'm really going through it right now, okay? And I'm doing the best that I can. And today I said, you know what? I'm going to take a break before I get back to work. Let me take my kids out to eat. Let's go to Costco's. We're going to go to Costco's, guys. So we can go look at the flooring um, for the garage. It's supposed to be like this rubber mat. And I wanted to show you guys in there. So, you know, we've tried, I've tried to find a good, a little, a good bit. So I can we can go in Costco so I can show y'all that stuff in there, and then after that, um, I'm gonna head back home so I can. I got some more orders that came in, and I said I would be shipping today also. So today's gonna be my last day of shipping out any orders until March 31st. I'm not shipping out. Any. So I had to get my nails fixed yesterday, right? So you see that crack, right? So they I have like an overlay on my nails, so to keep them, yeah. So. I'm gonna. Re I left the designs on, so I'm gonna repaint them myself. So you know, I have all those nail polishes on all that rack. Just eat your food, please. I have nail polishes on my rack, and I don't even use them. And it's like money's just. And I collect these nail polishes because I'm in love with Essie nail polishes, and they're just sitting on the rack. So I'm gonna take some time out to relax myself. And my way is one of my biggest ways to relax myself is to actually put nail polish on my nails. Like I love to do that. That is something that relaxes me. Doing word puzzles, coloring in my coloring book. Those are the simple ways that I'm able to have some downtime to myself or make me feel like I'm human again and, you know, I'm not just a workaholic. So everybody has the, yes, that's my pampering time. We all have our little things that we do that gives us our downtime, that makes us more comfortable, that kind of like helps to de us to de-stress. And those are my ways. What are, your, what are some of you guys' ways of what you do to de-stress? And I want you guys to think about those things. And I want you to think about making time out for yourself to do those things. If you like to color in your coloring book, call it. If you like to shine your shoes, shine your shoes. If you like to press your clothes, if you like to press your underwear, press your jeans. If you like to um, try on different lipsticks. Yeah, if you like to do yoga, um, tai chi, if you like to um, do um, Zumba, if you like to watch some TV, if you like to just like maybe sit on your porch, sit and eat your food, Julian. If you like to sit on your porch and watch 
you just listen to the nature music, listen to the nature sounds and stuff, do those things. You, there's so many different things that everybody, yes, you see? So, you know me, I want to get a, a deep tissue massage. That's something. Yes, I love, yes, and y'all know I love music. My client checking out your before and after on the, oh, she is? <laughs> I like to sit by my window or play in my yes and like I love to or you know what I love to organize my makeup that that makes me smile that makes me feel good that really makes my day just tell your client I said hi <laughs> and um we all have to find ways as women men human beings period to take the time out for ourselves just to do something for ourselves just to do something that for ourselves and we get so caught up in working, taking care of the world, where we don't take care of ourselves, right? But I'm urging you, if you have some time this weekend, if you can make the time, no, I'm not going to ask you. Wait, is that our sh Yes, it is. Well, you already had them. I'm going to be making a whole brand new design. Hi, sister. <laughs> I'm gonna be. Remember, you told Josiah. Picked, um, yeah, I took off the liner. Remember, Josiah told you Josiah picked out an outfit for me yesterday. He picked out the outfit for me yesterday, and I didn't. Um, we went somewhere. I wore, I wore white. You didn't even get to see what I had on. Some of we had um um exactly. So I had. Um, a white t-shirt, a white shirt, and some tights on. I looked cute yesterday, but I didn't come back on because I was so frustrated yesterday. I was so frustrated yesterday. I couldn't even come on because I, that's how upset I was. I literally so mad that I had to literally, I took my medicine and I went to sleep yesterday. Hi, this is Miss Achu from Ekta. I'm her client. Hi, sister. How are you? Welcome. Make sure you get a periscope. Come on down, sister. Come join the family. Let's have a good time. <laughs> so, um, I had a client who want a customer who actually wanted to purchase my product. All my transactions are done through PayPal. My my products have to be accounted for because why? Because I report to my accountants, and that's how I keep telling this is business, you know. And I was dealing with that too, also. So that was kind of like. I'm just doing my best to not let a lot of things frustrate me anymore and stuff because when I say when you when you um, especially if you're dealing with an online business my business is an online business now if I'm at a vending event and you want to be able to purchase you can or if you're in this area you can so um, I'm trying to not think about business right now and just have a mommy moment and just have a chill a Junette moment not a jazzy moment not a I'm just trying to have a Junette moment I'm just trying to have a Junette moment for myself to just feel like I'm alive again. Like, yes, I need that. Like, I deserve to have a Junette moment. And it's like, I feel guilty just having my own moment for myself. Like, I can just never breathe and just say, yo, Ju, just, it is okay just to be. Eat your food, please. Mommy wants some time alone. Put it like that. Really? <laughs> really, sis? Like, and I hear that a lot. No, don't feel guilty, but I know. See? Hi Isaiah, hey brother, how are you my love? And I never knew you, yes, my first name, my first name is Jeanette, is, Ju is Junette in, in English, but the way you pronounce my name in French is Jeanette, okay, Jeanette Milan is my name. Yes, she lived in Jamaica, but she passed, wow, Ingrid and Cecilia, yes, and, and that's my problem, like, I feel... I'd be feeling so guilty. Yeah, I'd be feeling so guilty just trying to take some time out for myself. 
behind me up some cases. And I'm tired, like, you know, I just, I wanna sleep. Like, I wish I could just sleep for like a whole day. But in between, you know how your kids can be and stuff, you know, and it's like, I'm trying to work. I wanna take some time out for myself. I wanna rest and I gotta watch them. And, um, Keep them occupied, keep them smiling. I do this. And all I could think about is like, oh, I want to eat. I want to run to Costco's and I want to go back home so that, yeah, aren't they? My granny always said, self-preservation is the first law of men. It can't be good for others. If you, honey, you better say it, sis. Mm-mm. We're at pizza. I'm dying in here. Pizza Hut. And they got the little buffet there. We're at Pizza Hut. It's my first time ever eating in here. <laughs> other than coming, yes, other than just coming, ordering something. Exactly. They have everything to keep them occupied, right? But sometimes it's so frustrating because I feel like, you know, your kids, kids are just ungrateful. Can I have this? Can I have that? Like, they just, but they're kids, you know, they're kids. Ew, they, they're kids. So, they don't, they're too young. It's the hardest thing I've ever do. Mm. Yes, yes. What I said was, I'm going to take them to bounce house today and just let them go play. Do you know what I'm going to do while I'm at bounce house? I'm going to bring my blanket while I'm at bounce house. And I'm going to sit on that couch and I'm going to take me a nap what? while they watch me. We're going to bounce house. You want more? No. We're going to go to bounce house while they're playing. I'm going to have my little blanket over my head and I'm going to lay in, in, in the crevices of the couch. And I'm gonna go to sleep can while they play for two hours. I'm gonna give you a two hour nap. Watch. Can I give you a pillow? Mm-mm. Oh, yeah. Use your pillow that you sit on. I'm gonna bring my pillow and my blanket. Hmm. Watch. No, it's not really cold in there. They're gonna be looking at this like, yo, she tired. Yeah, don't talk to me. Leave me be. Hi, Evie. Hey, sister. I'm gonna park myself so far in that couch in the corner. Look, I'm gonna have, look, it's like I'm gonna be, I'm gonna have the blanket over my head. I'm gonna have my nice little pillow. And I'm gonna tell Josiah, I said, you come in and pop in on me and check up on my on mommy. Just make sure I'm I'm alive. Cause today was so funny. While we was at, um, I was, I went to the doctor to get Josiah's blood work today. What was I doing? I was sitting and my heart started to hurt me. Most of y'all know that I have a hole in my heart. I have a heart murmur. And, um, I was sitting in it and I was in pain, right? I know, right? I didn't, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't eat yesterday. I didn't eat yesterday, guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was so tired, I just wanted to sleep. I was so upset by the time I got in the house after I finished taking care of stuff. I was so frustrated, I literally was so mad. I talked to Inez, Inez, me and Inez was on the phone until like maybe about one, two o'clock. Did I go to sleep? Man, we, I didn't go to sleep until three o'clock in the morning. Yep. Three o'clock in the morning. Eat your food, please. I was, I didn't go to 3 o'clock in the morning. Inez said, Junette! I jumped up and screamed, like, oh, what happened, Inez? She said, were you sleeping? And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I have dementia, sometimes I just want to scream. Oh. Well, you were kind of, you were kind of, my head. Jen, I can't even imagine, I know. And that's what sucks the most, when you feel like, <laughs> All you got and everything is burnt out on you and you got nobody there's no outlet nobody to look to for help and that's the position I'm in where I feel like I have no help you know but then you have people say oh Juju if you need me call me and I'll come and help you but when you call them they're never around that's why I don't ask nobody for help people always disappoint me so that's why I don't even waste my time asking people for help um, it shouldn't be like that. I know. And then you have the ones. If they do something for you. I know, sis. You know what they'll say? Well, you didn't call anybody. Or, why did this and why did that happen? 
You don't call nobody. But when I ask, you're never available, ever. Don't ask me and tell me if I need something, call you, and then you're never there. Yes, that's what I was trying to say. Are the ones who do something for you, they want to throw it in your face later. And they're not doing it from the bottom of my heart. When I do things, I don't be doing stuff because I'm expecting something. I don't need nothing from anybody. When I do stuff, I do it because, and at true at heart, I just want to do it. I just want to help. That's it. I'm not looking for anything in return. And that's what sucks. So that's kind of like why, that's why I'm a loner. Like if a lot of y'all don't know, how often do y'all really see people around me? It's just usually y'all just see me, or y'all just see me and my kids, or it's like my girlfriends who come over to come get their hair done or something like that. But I don't hang on anybody. Like I am a loner. I am, and so, I'm not an extrovert. I am an introvert. And y'all, if I say that, y'all would be shocked. Like what? That you, you're very outgoing? No, I'm not. I'm a person that keeps to myself. <laughs> I love you too, sis. But you know what? A lot of us are like that too. But you know, we just won't say that out loud. You know? We won't say that out loud. Honey, I'll be the first to tell you. Since far as I'm on this by default, unless they run this. Yeah. And, I, and you see, I don't. Where I be at at the top, guys? In my room? Y'all see how much I live in my house? Sala gets on me all the time. Sala's always in my butt. Juju, you need to go outside. Go outside. Go outside, Juju. I'm like, okay. Let me tell you what I do. You, I'm frozen? Just like me. I know. Just. <laughs> do you know the kind of things that I do? I, do you know? I'll, Sala, you tell me that. Look, I'll be right in front of my window. I will get dressed. I will look outside the window. And then I get so turned off that I'm like, oh, never mind. I don't want to go outside. I will lay down in my bed and I'll just, I'll just, I'll lay down in my bed and I'll stare out the window. I'll just stare out the window and, and I'll never, get, I won't get out that bed. It happens to me all the time. I have anxiety when I go to Walmart. Like say friends, it's like night now. I'll have a panic attack going into like, I have to go to college because I'm already here. But I only like to go to certain, don't y'all always notice when I say I'm going to Walmart and stuff, it's always late in the evening because it's not a lot of people. I like to go there late at night because it's therapeutic for me. Not necessarily that I have to go spend money, but just the fact that I can walk in there and I can walk around in the store. I'm a person, guys, who's, I'm a person, guys, that suffer from severe depression, okay? I suffer from it bad. I'm an up and down roller coaster a lot of the time. Some days I'm up, some days I'm down. And the most things that trigger me more so is, you know, things that's going on, you know, just, you know, me and my kids and I need help or because I'm feeling overwhelmed or just some days I'm just feeling down and, um, and I pray, you know? Yeah, yeah. But see, I'm honest with these things with you guys because there's somebody on the other side of the screen who's going through what I'm going through. And people look at you, oh, your life is so perfect. You got everything and everything's big. You don't know what I'm going through. Y'all just see what you see. You just see what you see, but you don't know what people are battling, man. Y'all don't understand. Like, when I say severe depression is real. Yes. <coughs> oh, those things that y'all done. Thank you so much, man. Thank you. Thank you. Can I have this? Yeah. Put on, you can just eat it, okay? And like, some days I don't want to deal. Some days I don't want to talk to nobody. Some days I don't even want to be around my kids. You hear me? Some days I don't even want to be around my kids. I just want to break. You know? Because you're, especially when you're doing so much, you're doing so much, and then, say for instance, like I get my little break from my kids, then they'll come in my room, they'll get in the bed with me, and they hug me and they cuddle with me, and then they calm me down. Sometimes it just takes that for me. You know how excited I am at night? Ain't he? You know how excited I am at night when I know my kids are gonna get in the bed with me and we're just gonna cuddle and they're gonna hug me and Josiah rub my head, Julian will uh, rub my big stomach. <laughs> Julian will be like, Mommy, why is your stomach so big? What's wrong with it? You have to fix it, Mommy, you gotta fix it. Do you need to put on your girdle? <laughs> Do you need to put on your girdle? That's what she says. Juno says, Mommy, do you need to put on your girdle? Do you need so to we can go back down? Mom, do you want your girdle? <laughs> so we can go back down and stuff for that? 
Kids will say something to me. Oh, yeah, I'm so funny. It was. Yeah, it They would say, things, they would say something so funny to me. And then. I am. I. Well, I'm trying to do this so you can see all of us. Y'all can sit in. Come on, move over, guys. And, um, and then they'll say something to make me laugh. And it's like. No matter how. Who's there? Banana. Who? Banana. Banana who? Banana coming. bread. Banana <laughs> bread. <laughs> Keep them hearts coming, people. We're not just not. having a conversation. I don't care about y'all hearts right now. Not now. We're just having some family time. Okay. Not the kids not. just love to see them, I guess, guys. So. Um. <laughs> you know? And like now, like guys. You see him, right? Banana bread, brown bread, brown bread. I just got a haircut too, guys. I took him to get another haircut. Like, he just, look at this. He got a haircut last week, Wednesday. <gasps> He's chill appealing. Do you know his hair grew up that fast? It's like he didn't have a haircut, so I took him today. Mm-hmm. Banana That's bread, a banana, and pizza. Yeah. <laughs> and look, so, so I said, I said, Wayne, hold this eye up and give him a nice, um, turn your head to do Oh, honey, always fly. <laughs> oh. So, you know, it's funny when I'm we walk in the street. Alcohol. And he's like, oh my God, like you spit him out. Y'all look just alike. I see our nose. Do you know, like, do you, guys, you ever remember when we went to Burlington Coach Factory? This was the jacket, guys, stand up so you can show everybody. Guys, this was the jacket that I got for $16.99 at Burlington Coach Factory. Turn around to do I got this jacket for six, you remember that? Yes, yes, that's the jacket I got for $16.99. And this is an actual girl jacket. And I got it for $16.99 at Burlington Coach Factory. Yeah, you know I'll tell you where to go. I'll tell you to go. I'm still hungry. It's like I feel like I'm eating for five people. I can't wait to go to Costco. Mommy, I'm telling you right now, I could eat more than you right now if I wanted to. Knock, knock. For backpack shopping? Oh, you mean like book bag? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This piece is so good. Yeah. You said, who's there? Look, Miss Christy said, who's there? Ra I mean, rock. Rock. Hold on, wait. She said rock, Wait, everybody's going to say, she said rock. She rock. said rock. Wait for her to say rock who? Rock cheese. You don't want to eat rock cheese. Because they're Look. delicious. Felicia says, knock, knock. Who's there? He said, who's there? She says, move. You say what? Move. Move. Who? You say, move. Who? Move. Who? You like, move. Who? <laughs> Not move who's who. there? Move. Who? Who? You like to move. You like to, you like to drink cow. Everybody, look. Cow. Everybody, knock, knock. Who's there? Snicker. Put mom in a moo moo. She can keep, he can take a nap. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, if anybody who's coming to Perry Union, Snicker. I'm Snicker. hoping if you're coming to Perry Union, right? <laughs> She's a Snicker. Y'all know we having a, a, a slumber party in my in my room at Perry Union. We are having a slumber party at my room. Everybody's gonna be in, in onesies. Mommy. Y'all yeah, better make sure y'all look at her. Bring your flyest heels. Never say that. And your onesies. And we're late. gonna be in our onesies with some heels on. Don't play. <laughs> they are. Look. 
It's in Las Vegas. I'm stay. I'm. Uh, I don't know. Mommy. Okay. April knows. <laughs> I just paid. I just paid the money for my flight, and then I paid for the hotel. So wherever she told me I was staying at, I was like, okay. And I said, how much is it? And I just paid Use it. So Airbnb. I don't know. News Airbnb. What does that mean, sis? Hi, Rich. Rose, Brooklyn. Brooklyn in the house. I wish I had a babysitter. Yeah, because at first I was going to take my kids with me, but then I thought about it. How are you, love? And I thought about it. Give me another cheese pizza, too. Here, here, take this one. You're Just killing me, cheese pizza. Because I'm hungry. Yeah, I know, guys. I didn't really eat anything. Yeah. Just I had lodging at a home, like basic apartment. Really? Wow. Brooklyn in the house, honey. I can't wait to come back home. I wait, didn't know that. Y'all should wow. see me and my brother Kachan. We don't oh, play with food. April was telling me about that. that would, wouldn't that be cool with a kitchen? So I wouldn't have to be doing all this fast food and stuff. Yeah, I'm from Brooklyn, New York. I'm from Brooklyn. And I have um I left New York in 2002. Yep, 2002, I left New York. My family's still there, my um, my sisters, my aunts, my daddy. My mom is the only one who actually left. My mom moved to Maryland. I finally got her to leave New York. But um, you're from Fort, Fort Greene? I've had a couple of friends um, who, lived off in, who lived in Fort Greene. Yep, mm -hmm. wow. And then um, uh, I had a couple of friends who live in Red, Red Hook. Are you for real? In a private Wow, place. that's amazing, sis. I have friends who live in Red Hook. Um, I'm No, I'm from Eastern Parkway. You know where um, Eastern Parkway between Bedford and Rogers is? That's where I'm from. $60. Wow, that's cool. I like that. Crown Heights, Brooklyn, yep. Crown Heights, Brooklyn. Um, and um, do you know where Brevoort Projects is? And all and and Albany projects. Eat the heart. That's when I was a kid. That's where all I hung out. Well, all my friends. Yes, that's where all I hung when I was a kid. <laughs> yeah. Well, look, no, y'all should see y'all should see me and my brother Kashan eat. We do not play with food. Probably now. Yeah. Because when you know, we're was it back then? It probably was, but we were so young kids Sign then. Up. That's when you were in, no, mm -mm. I've only been stationed here in Virginia. My whole entire service, I've stayed, I was stationed here in Virginia. My first um, duty station was supposed to be Guam, but let me tell you what happened. My instructor, my instructor told me, because I was one of the people who, who graduated at the top of my class, right? She told me that, what was your, M what does MOS mean? That's a different term. Who's that for? That's is that That's army. Not hard, yeah. <coughs> my rate? Oh, my rate was an EM. I was an electrician. Um, I was supposed to go to Guam, but my instructor told me not. She said, "Juju, do not do it. Change it. You need to go. Go get the um. Get on the ship. Go get to go to the um USS. Go to the um Harry S. Truman. Ele uh, electrician. Oh, no. Right. <coughs> so she was like, if you go out there. Never out, yes, oh, yes, of course. Surprising, I did two cruises, mm -hmm. Very surprising. right? So, so, let me tell you what happened. So, um, let me let me finish my story. So, um, I forgot what I was about to say. Yeah, she told me not to go to Guam. She said, because if you go to Guam, the Filipinos only look out for themselves and they're not gonna look out for you. So, you need to go on a ship. To this day, sometimes I wish I just didn't listen to her. I wish I, you know, listen to somebody else and you not know, be discouraged. So I was like, are you for real? She's like, yes, they just look out for one another. Yeah. Is Guam racist? No, I don't even believe that. Like, I mean, I've never been there, but I okay. felt bad because I'm like, why did I listen to that? I should have went. Because I adapt anywhere I go. Everybody loves me. You get what I'm saying? Like, everybody loves me. So I'm just looking like I always fit in wherever I go. So I should have went. Because I'm telling you. If I'd have went to Guam, them Filipinos, them Filipinos would have taught me some stuff. You hear me? They would have taught me some stuff. 
And then, so instead of what I did, I went to the Truman. But I went to the Truman, but I met my best friend at the Truman. You know, I met my best friend at the Truman. And then from there, uh, I met so many great people. I met one of my, my female best friends. I met so many great people, people that I love. To this day, we're still friends now, so many years later. I wouldn't have my children. I would never met my children's fathers, and I wouldn't have my beautiful kids, you know? So everything happened for a reason. So when I, started, when I was mad at her for so long, and after a while, I'm like, yo, what if I went to Guam? I still would have been in the military, probably. And you know what? Y'all wouldn't even know me. I would have, what are you doing? Um, and then what I would have done was, um, don't ever eat from the table again. Do you understand? So, if I was, um, if I was, if I had went to Guam, y'all wouldn't even know me right now. I wouldn't be on Periscope. I wouldn't even be on social media. My name probably wouldn't be Jazzy Jujubee. I would probably still be in the service, and I've still been doing hair while I was in the service, but I would not be here right now. You know what I'm saying? So everything, yeah. So now, exactly, so now I'm happy I didn't go to Guam. All these things I've accomplished, you know, would I be retired right now? Probably not. I probably not. I'm happy that I left New York. I'm happy that I left. My my um my ex at the time he was trying to convince me not to go. My mom didn't even believe I was going to the Navy. They, everybody was trying to convince me not to go. No, don't go, don't go. That was the best decision I ever made because let me go Let me tell you something. Be seated, please. Be seated. If it wasn't for if it wasn't for me, um, if it wasn't for me leaving New York, I would probably be in the same place as a lot of the people that I know. Like, you know, like, I'm 33, two homes, you know, I have two kids, you know, you know, like, and I go back home, I have people who are still living at home with their parents, you get what I'm saying, like, oh, they got mad kids, children's father little, they don't know who they are, I mean, just dead, just that mentality of just buying nice clothes and not trying to think about when to retire or save money or you don't want a better life like you think I want that for my life I didn't want that for my life that's why I left I left and look I did so well for myself so when I look back now would I change anything nah I wouldn't change anything I would not I'm happy everything everything happens for me sometimes you know we need mad and we're like oh my god why is this happening to us believe you me it's happening for a reason you just don't realize what that reason is later but it's always a lesson in everything that you do thank you boo thank you so much thank you there's a reason the things that I'm going through right now there's a reason I'm going through it there's a reason because this is gonna be a story for somebody else I'm telling you and these are the things, but you see, sometimes it takes for me to get on here when I start talking to you guys, and then it's like my mind starts moving, and I start really thinking about it and start really reflecting. You would never be, honey, you better say that, Isaiah, I would never be a period. I wouldn't have been doing, I wouldn't have done all the magazine work, because I'm a published stylist, you know, I'm a published hair care professional. I wouldn't have done all these things. There's so many things I've done, I've accomplished, I've done, I would have never done anything. Look. Different scenery, different atmosphere, different people. You know who I was watching? Does anybody know who Eric Thomas is? I shared it on my Facebook page. I'm going to share it in the Glam Tribe too, but let me tell you something. That man had me so pumped yesterday. He's a motivational speaker. This man had me. I'm not really moved by a lot of people, but this man had me so moved. That's why I couldn't sleep last night. Part of the reason. Yes! Yes! I said. Isaiah, that man had me on a million last night. You hear me? He had me so hyped that I wanted to work. He had me so encouraged that I said, yo, I even feel like crying right now. All because this man, he inspired me. Hi, God's love. Hello, beautiful. How are you? He pushed me. He drove me last night because I'm like that. You know, like I'm, I'm, I'm that, I'm the rah-rah person. I'm a very rah-rah person, you know? And he was just giving it and I said Lord have mercy and I said sometimes I'm afraid of my own mouth his name is Eric Thomas Eric Thomas go find him on Facebook sis when I tell you when I see him standing on stage speaking and I could see myself watching him 
I was able to see myself speaking in front of thousands of people. That's what I envisioned. I envisioned myself speaking in front of thousands of people and affecting people, touching people's lives. And, and speaking in such a way of just real talk, not just just the real talk, the, authentic, the authenticity of who I am, where I come from, why I move the way I move, and wanting people to feel good about themselves and for them to be happy. Um, yeah, I guess kind of like more like in a conference where I'm actually in a place where it's for me. Of uh, people coming out to see me and listening to me speak. Because I have a story to tell. I have so many hugs to give out. I have so many people to encourage. I have so many people just to hug. There's so many of us who need healing. And it's an amazing feeling when you're in a room of people. When you're in a room with people that you just want to see them happy. There are so many people I have not met till now. I haven't even met, been introduced to them. Yeah, who needs a hug from me? Who just needs to hear that it's going to be okay? And I'm crying because I want to help people. And there's a lot of hurt people out there who just need to be uplifted and, and, and to know that somebody out there cares about them who's never met them or seen them before. Um, there are so many people out here who wish to speak, to hear, to see, just to find somebody who can understand them and just accept them for them being themselves. Let's go home and get these packages. And then we can go get to Bell's house. No, we're going to go to Bell's house real quick. We're going to go to Bell's house. And it's yeah, like I would love to put together an event, to but I guess I'm so nervous. Mother. <laughs> I'm Mommy. so nervous that people wouldn't show. Mommy, you know you have us for them to show. Yes. You see these little faces, right? These yeah. little faces will attract people. What little faces will attract people? Look here, here, just like it. <laughs> What little faces will attract people? This face, that face, and this big face right here is going to attract people. You A mean lot of this people. big face? What? This big face. <laughs> It'll attract <laughs> a lot of people. <laughs> A lot of people. These two, these two little faces are gonna attract uh, a lot of people. Look how many A lot. A very long. I just want to say that I want you guys to. They're always with you, mommy. I know. They're I just want here. you guys to be encouraged. Um, I want you guys to be uplifted, and I want you to be empowered. Because we don't have a lot of positivity. There is a lot of positivity around. We just don't know where to find it. <laughs> and and that's the part of the problem. And I feel if it's more of us that come together and unite. I want to be amongst other people who want to make a difference. Who just want to give people hugs. Just because. Just because. Not because you're expecting anything back. The only thing that I want for you to expect back is for someone to receive it. I want them to receive your spirit, receive your positive energy. 
I want them to feel that they will be okay and knowing that God loves them. And no matter what you're going through, there's someone out there who could be going through far worse. But at the end of the day, there is always a pot of gold at the end of that rainbow. But you just have to believe that it's there. You just have to step out on faith. And sometimes a lot of us are giving up too soon. I'm a Virgo. We give up too soon. We don't even, we, we end the race before we even start it. Because in your mind, you have it programmed in your mind that I can't do it. I can't make it happen. I can't accomplish it. I don't know what tomorrow's, I don't know what tomorrow's going to bring, but you know what? I am not going to put my first foot forward just to leap out on faith and just take that first initial step to get started. I need to, can I go take this off and put it in the trash? There you go. Go put it in the trash and put your jacket on. Sit still, still, please. Can I put it in the trash? Okay. Um, yes. We, we do. What happened to your belly? She said, don't you? <laughs> Mommy, what happened to your belly? Is it all right? Are you trying to die down? So, put your jacket. Put your jacket. So, my son just likes to move around too much. And I just want him to keep still. Just See, when you see them back and forth and fidgeting and moving back and forth, it drives me crazy. Like, it, 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 it drives me crazy. Here, put your jacket on. So, let me finish eating my last piece of pizza. One more. It's my crush. Do you want to have that crush with the mushroom? I wish I was meeting so many of you guys at Perry Union next week. Like, Wait, that's I wish I was seeing so many of you guys at Perry Union. Hi, Jen. Hi, sister. Hey, well, let's go fast, mommy. Don't I'm always mommy. trying. I'll be trying not to, but it'd be so hard because it'd be so hard. I can't help it. Okay, boo. Text me, Angie. We're about to leave. I just want to finish drinking my drink. you, Jen. Apparently, I think everybody's great. Everybody brings something unique to the table. Everybody has a unique spirit. I just feel that some people feel like, you know, I'm the, nah, honey, everybody's amazing and unique in their own way. Everybody has something to give, no matter the sign, race, gender, um, Mommy, it doesn't Mommy. matter, you know? So, at the end, come on, let's go, guys. Yes, we are. Come on, let's go. We gotta go to Costco's. So, guys, we even gonna, um... Oh, my. Guys, I tell you that I have such a hard time sleeping at night. Um... Yeah. No, you're not getting out of So. Come on, Juju. Let's plug up the phone. Come on, Juju. Oh my God, it's such a beautiful day, guys. Oh, look, there was my phone dying, as always. She is. Put your seatbelt on, Juju. Here. Oh, I hurt myself. Here, too, too. You can hold the phone because I can't sing while I'm driving. You just read. Okay. Hey. And you read the comments, right? So, 
sit properly in your chair, please. Thank you very much. All right, so guys, we are going to Costco's. What time we got? 1.42, so we still good because Josiah's appointment is not till 3.30. Are you reading the comments? Mm-hmm. Hey, Michael Jackson. Yes, honey. I really want to go into Best Buy, but we're going to go to, um, we're going to go to Costco's first. Enjoying your day, Josiah? Oh, yeah. Yes, I am. We're gonna go into, um, we're gonna go into Best I really, really thought. Can we stay in here and you can go on Best Buy and get some stuff real quick? No, we cannot. I thought, I really thought that Costco's was on. Is there anybody who's in the Hampton Roads area? Anybody live in Hampton Roads? Or live near Hampton Roads? If there's anybody who's in Hampton Roads, does anybody know where Costco's is? Is there Costco's in Suffolk up. or Chesapeake? I put a thumbs was... up. Put a thumbs up if you We parked do. anyway. Put a thumbs up because the daddy. Um, I miss what you wrote, sis. I'm trying to figure out. Where's the Costco's? If there's a Costco's in Chesapeake. Guys, look at my hair. The sun is shining, honey. I would love to color my hair, but I'm not. Let's just go. Okay, let's go to Best Buy. And my phone is done. I wish I had some more juice. Hey, Juju, Ju you see my purse back there? Yeah. Grab my purse, boo. Let's go into Best Buy, guys. Let's go see what's in there. I hope I can hold up a little bit of juice. We ain't got no juice on my phone. Let's close this window. Why is the phone? All right. Let's, let's go into Best Buy. He said, let's see if they have any maps on sale. Yeah, let's see what they got going on. I, there's a camera that I want. It was trying to make me wait, but see, I don't have patience. So I want, when I want my stuff, I want my stuff now. Oh, Let me put on my, my purse. You don't want to take off your jacket? Just like, uh, can I? Yeah, come on. Go back over. Take your jacket off. Come on, everybody. Let's go. Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Hurry up. Okay, let's go. So, we're, guys, we're going. We're off. Let's come on. Let's go shopping. Hello, how are you? We're going on to Best Buy. So, there's Best Buy, and then there's Ross over there. It's beautiful, guys. The weather is so nice outside. It is really, 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 really nice. Josiah, can you pull down your high water pants down? There ain't no flood, boy. So. Okay. All right. Let's go look. Let's go look for this camera. Um, yeah, I did it with a Julian. So we know about that. It's a laptop. Okay, let's go find. Alvin, I came up. I see laptops. No. Microsoft. Are y'all looking for Macs or are we looking for laptop? Yeah, no, I don't know nothing about no um, Microsoft or whatever. Hi, where are your Macs? Max, 
Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go look at some snacks. Let's see what they got. All right. Oh, there we go, guys. Look. Oh. Oh, guys. Okay. Ju Josiah. Yeah. So this one right here is the Apple MacBook. MacBook Pro, so this is what the 17 inch or something? Uh, no, it's not a 17. Oh, it's a 15 point. 15 point. That's bigger than both of mine's, right? But it's does it have a CD? No, no CD in this one, so is this kind of like an error or something like uh, that? No, none of the laptops in general are coming with the disk drive. Anymore. The new ones, mm -hmm. yeah, because mine's right are old. Here. So, oh, you just plug you it to... in, they're real, real thin. Uh huh. You push plug it, it in USB. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Isn't that cool, guys? And then we have this one. What's the difference with this one? I think that's the one I've got, but I have the older version. It's a little smaller, not quite as thin. Yeah. Um, it's thick. It's a little bit. Not. It's not going to be quite as quick. A little bit slower processor. Like mine. Mm-hmm. What about that one? There. Those are just made to be as thin as possible. Just to be thin, but doesn't move as fast either. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, what size? This is little. This is small, guys. Does it, isn't this tiny? Oh my god, it's so little. It just look nothing compared to mine. That's really small. I just have the larger one, too. I have the big one. Oh, this is, this is, why well, didn't you see it? Mm, this is small, but it's cute. It's cute, too. So, I, I guess about all these processings, and I don't know what none of that stuff means. Like, Apple Mac 21.5 inch, okay, and then 2.8 QC. What does that mean? Right, let me pull this little thing up. Guys, we're learning today, guys. We're learning. What's your name? My name is Wait. Wait? Wait. Wait. Hi, Mr. Wait. Thank you for your help. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we're learning today as we're vlogging and roaming the streets. The first, that's. The, the one that's 1200 is okay. The one that's, tw yeah, the one that's 1200 is, uh, which one? You mean the, the laptop says? That one? So this one right here is 949, right? Mm hmm. That's the thin one, the little air one. Mm hmm. And then you can get a slightly, a slightly larger hard drive one. Oh, this larger or hard drive. Mm -hmm. Okay, with the largest. To me, the smart thing to do. <laughs> for the hard drive, you're not gonna keep all that memory on it. Go get yourself an external hard drive. Go get buy yourself a four terabyte, like how I got. And then you transfer so you can save some money. That's if you want to save money. But if that's what you want, you can pay more. Then we have the this one that I've got. It moves hella slow. It does. It does lose move slow. I like this because it's a big screen. And it's got a faster new generation processor. It has a faster processor. A faster processor, so it's gonna move a lot quicker. Mm -hmm. Going from the i5 to the i7. That's not gonna move quick. No. This, this that's the one's gonna go quick purchase. one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's if y'all wanna spend all that money for that one, right? Yeah, like for all the stuff that I do, I need mine to move quick. But um, if you just want a look, and then they have another one right here too. Look, another one, a little small one, seven hundred and ninety-nine dollars for another little small one. I mean, that's cool too. You would be able to store more space like the other one. I've missed it, Angie. Yeah. Okay. So y'all happy with the laptops? I'm looking for a camera. It's the Sonya 51, Sonya A1500 or something like that. Cameras? Yeah, okay. on the other side there somewhere. I'm gonna go look at the happy camera. Where's Juju? Oh, so where's, what? Oh, and what was so this? Why, is this why you got my um, finger? So what is Julen looking at? Hello. Hello, Julen. Yes. Oh. Come here. Y'all stay right there, right? Y'all stay together. Let's go walk around. Let's go see. Which one was it? Sonia. Sonia A fifteen hundred. Um. No, when I see it, I don't see it. The Sony. It's a Sony, right? Sony. The Sony A fifteen hundred. Is this where all the cameras are at? Mm. 
Where's that other camera that I have? This is a nice camera too, guys. Oh, look at this good tripod. It's a lot of damn money. Sony, and they got a, what you call it in the back? A, 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 the screen comes out? No. Um, it's not going to pop out on these, but it does have a screen. Sony Alpha A. What? That's not it. Sony mirrorless camera. What does that mean? Mirrorless camera. Mirrorless. It's um, typically with a lot of cameras, you'll have like a mirror where it'll the reflect flipper? the image up to a viewfinder for you. But oh. this one doesn't have the mirror. It's not going to be reflecting and changing the, oh. the way the. But so they don't have the one that actually flips like. The part this it like pops up. I don't think we have it at this store. Um, well, let's see. This one I think does actually. Let's see. Yeah. There it goes. Yep. But there, are, um, yeah, some larger stores have um, more varieties. Okay. That's enough looking for me. Yep. Yep. Thank you so much, hon. Mm -hmm. You too. Watch my kids, guys. Julian. Yes. What is it that you're doing right now? This is another one that I need. I have this that I purchased this for my boards, and um, you can get this at um, um at Office Max, and you can get it. I'm sure much much cheaper. You don't have to spend a lot of money for one of these if you want to like hold one of yours. I have one. This is a little cheap one. It ain't really expensive. But it's cool though. Come on. Come on. Are we losing service? That's who's here with me. Is, can anybody see what I'm looking at? Come on, Tutu. Okay. SD cards. Julian. Yes. Come on. Come hey, on. Aww. I want to keep that one. Let's go. I wanted to watch it, but. I can't do anything. Let's let's go look at some pretty pretty cases. No. For for laptops and stuff. No. Remember the case that I got from my computer that I showed you guys? Yeah. I bought it from here. Mom, that you can yeah. put in there and you can carry your lap your laptop and stuff in. Mom, now look I'm at this. Isn't this pretty? Get <gasps> that up, Juju. Mommy, I don't beautiful? have a computer. Oh my goodness. If that is not beautiful, I don't know what else to tell you. My own having a computer. Huh? I don't have a computer. Okay. Because I never get to have one. Why? Why is it you don't have one? Come on, let's go. Who, who are you talking to? Let's go. Come on, Josiah. Can any of y'all see me? I'm sure we're probably losing signal or something. I'm not sure yet. But oh, y'all are here. Okay, 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 okay. We, where we gonna? It could be. My, I'm looking for S. Look, that's an iPhone. I don't know what that is. Come on, Julian. Oh, oh, I'm looking for SD card. I am actually looking for SD card. So y'all are here. So y'all just see. Okay, come on. Come on, Juju. I'm looking for an SD card. Where are the SD cards? Stop. Get off her. So the, okay, there's the SD. What I'm looking for is a specific SD card. I'm going to show you how expensive these SD cards are. But the one that I have is a 256 um, um, gigabyte um, SD card that I have. See, they only sell like the 64. 64 means... Mm, oh, wait, no, no, that's, that's only 64. Cool. That's nothing. We need the 268 or 98 one, and they've got one right here. Look, like this is $69, 128 gigabytes. Yeah, for my camera, I have a 268 one. So I'm gonna go my butt right back on Amazon, and I'm gonna go to Amazon and I'm gonna buy it because I can get it for like a hundred dollars for that. Can you imagine how much something like that would cost me here? Come on, we go. Let's go. 
There's nothing that interests me. Those are the only things that interested me here. They don't. They have my camera, but um, I have other stuff at home. I want. You said I'm rich, though. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Uh, Juju just plays it. Go this way to Juju just plays wise. Hold my hand. Juju just plays wise with her money. That's what it is. Have a blessed day. Thank you. <laughs> Juju just plays wise with her money. That's all I do. I, I don't um Juju, my periscope got messed up. Please I I had I did, Jen. I heard you the first time. I already did that. So um what I said was um I'm just wise with what with my money and the things that I do with it, you know. So, hey guys, I'm even going to get the back of my car redone over. Also, my my um, so y'all can see. But let me tell you something. The reason why I I did all that. Look, right. Let me show you. See what it says. 100% natural, Jache essential oils. Okay. Um, Jazzy. Oh, somebody's a cowboy. <laughs> and it has jazzyjb.com. So I have to put jacheessentials.com. I have to remove that. And then I have that here. I'm probably going to leave that. And then it says eczema, dandruff, hair, hair growth, itchy scalp, inflammation, and razor bumps, right? So um, the reason I have my little logo right here on the side of my vehicle. I got to redo that over also so I can put Jache Essentials on it. So people walk up to my vehicle or even when I'm driving in the street, people have actually honked their horn at me and was like, oh my God, what? god you sell you sell natural products do you have a card and when they ask me if i have a card i tell them of course i have cards i always have cards oh my truck st is stacked with cards that's what i do my truck's always stacked with some cards right so um where can somebody do me a quick favor can somebody look up costco's Chesapeake, please. Because I know BJ doesn't have what I need. And I don't know what other store. That it said Costco's. That's what it said. And I could have swore I thought Costco's was on this side. Yes. Put Costco's. Put Costco's um, Chesapeake. And see what address pops up. So I don't have to get off here. And I can just put it in my navigation system. Because we got to go to Costco's. Josiah's appointment is at 3.30 with his doctor. And um, so hopefully it's in this area. If it's in this area, I can go and then go to Josiah's appointment and then um, knock that out. Or if it's not in this area and it's somewhere far, I'm going to go home and um, we're going to go home quickly and finish these orders and then drop them off at the post office. Glen Rock Road is in Chesapeake, sis. What's the um, exact address? Hold on. Mm. Give me one second. Ooh, it's hot. Ooh, it's hot. Guys, it is hot. I'm sweating. Just address. address. It's in Norfolk? Oh. Then I know where it is then. It's, 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 so that's the only Costco's out here then. Never mind then. Guess we're going home. Yay! We're going home. We're going home so that I can be able to... um. Knock out, knock out some of these, so I can knock out the rest of the orders that just popped up. Here, Juju, you can hold on. So let me tell you what I will do. I'll tell y'all what I'll do, cause it's it's not um perfect. Just got it. Thank you, sis. I'm gonna put it in my navigation, cause we gotta go to Costco's today. There's no ifs, ands, no buts about it. We're gonna be in the streets today. I do not want to be in the house. Um, I want to go get these to. orders real quick. I want to be able to get Josiah's appointment done, and then we're gonna go roam the streets in the meantime. Yeah, it's all the way in Norfolk. And we're far from Norfolk, and Josiah's appointment is at 3.30. I told them to push it to 3.30. But in the meantime, if I go home now, I can do my customer's orders who came in today, ship out their stuff. So if there's anybody who's trying to order, y'all need to order now. So by the time I get home, I print out the shipping labels, and I can mail out your packages today, and you'll get it by Monday. And I won't be shipping out anything until March 31st. I'm going all the way on vacation. No more work. So, um... No more. Yeah, no more work. So I'm going to get all uh, they have no. one. They have one in Newport News. Where, what's the address in Newport? Oh my! I'm going to the one in Newport News. Oh, I'm going to the, give me the sister. Please give me the address for that one in Newport News. Yeah, yeah, go home. No, we are going home. We're just going to do it after. Oh yes, we're going to do it after. 
Honey, I still got to do my hair. I got to make these wigs. Oh, I got to so do my lashes you, and everything. Are you going to bounce house today? I sell all natural hair and body products, sis. You said, I'm not a sister? Rich, I know you're not a girl. <laughs> no scoping and driving, look, I'm in park. I guess I'll do Okay, well, just I got the phone. He can read what y'all write. Me. So we can go home. Right. Mommy, you reading? he is giving you info. Thank you. Mommy, I got a lot of stuff for my PlayStation yesterday for my game. That's nice. It's like these free costumes and free um Batmobiles that I got. It's so cool. It's Batman Arkham Knight. I mean, that's the game. Um, what's the, um... Going this way. Guys, I'm gonna tell you all my bat tools that I got yesterday because of my friend. Um, on my PlayStation, it's um, Batman Beyond, Batman Arkham. Oh, yeah, I already got that one. Um, there's two Batman Arkham Knight, um, two Batman Arkham Knight, um, costumes. There's a Batman, there's a Batman, um, with Bane in it. It has. Batman versus Superman. You need to create your own Periscope so you can sit there and talk about your gibber gabberish of your games and stuff. Because yeah, but how can folks, I? But I'm going to create one for you. You have one on your iPad because we don't even uh, know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. Do you know what Batman is? Because Who is this, Batman, Josiah? <laughs> Who is Batman? You heard what she said, right, y'all? You heard what she said. She just says you don't know who Batman is. Who is Batman? Who is Batman? Look, 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 look. Know it, who Batman is. Thank you, sis. I got it. She don't know who Batman is. Batman is on the it game. came out in like, like the 18s or the 17s. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he's on the game. That's why mommy don't know what Batman is. Because he don't know I can't believe you do not know. We don't know. Just you heard what she said, right? About, you heard what she said. She know I live with. I live. I cannot live without Batman games. You know that. You know, only mommy cares about Michael Jackson. I love Michael Jackson. Mommy loves Michael Jackson. Because <laughs> Michael Jackson is my best friend. Uh, you don't even know him. Who said I don't? Who told you I don't know Michael Jackson, Josiah? No. You never met him. I, do, I, I meet, I've met Michael Jackson. I meet him all the time. No, okay, yeah, where? Where friend. do you meet him? Because you know, finally, he lives in California, then he went to Florida, then he came to Virginia, then he went back to California, then he went to Chicago. Now he's back in California. Guys, we're gonna go home. Yes! We're going home because I gotta do these. And guys, when I get out my PlayStation, I'm gonna show y'all what the um thing that I'm talking about. So you can show your own little friends, your own stuff. My friends don't care about your back Everybody, make sure you come in my room. Make sure, please. Please, please, please. Oh, guys. Remember I was telling you guys about Gabe's? That's Gabe's over there. That's Gabe's. Gabe's. Right there, people. That's Gabe's. Right there. Gabe's has amazing things in there, okay? Lots of amazing things. Just hold it up. Gabe's has amazing things, clothes, shoes, things for the house. Oh my God, um, pictures, painting. Hold, Hold it up like that, please. I know, I was trying to put it in. Hold it up like that, please, All right? They have the most amazing things at games and for amazing prices. Now you read, there's you can tell Like, me. it's like Target. No, it's not like Target. It's not like Target, but it's only two things Target, in the um, room. Gabe's, Gabe's is, Gabe's is more so kind of like a Roses, <laughs> TJ Maxx, Marshalls. You can also find name brand clothes inside of Gabe's. Gabe's is an amazing place to go if you're looking for name brands that are not very, very expensive. Okay, okay? got it. So Gabe's has some amazing they even have home appliances in there. I love roses. Okay. So, yeah, think of Gates as a roses. I, I want to take you guys to roses also. Like, I love roses so much. So, y'all want to know where I
I get all my moons from, I go to Roses to get all of my moons. All my moons come from Roses. Oh, and from I like Gates. Marshalls and TJ Maxx. Marshalls and TJ Maxx. Yeah. Me too. Yeah, my 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 um my moons come from um from Gates and Roses. Those are the two places where I know for a fact I'm gonna find my moons. It is such a beautiful day out here. Look at, look, at the, on this, look at that. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Let's see what I know.
Value meals with four small nuggets instead of a I mean, spicy chicken sandwich, it. it's not for you. But if you Look want a double cheeseburger, later. spicy chicken That's sandwich, right. small fries, and a 16 ounce coat for four later. bucks, then it's definitely for you. The four dollar real deal at Hardee's. For limited time, participating restaurants excluding Hawaii and Alaska. Price may vary. Tax not included. No substitutions. Coca Cola is a registered trademark of the Coca Cola Company. We fly for lots of reasons. We fly all over the country for important business right. meetings. Taken the kids to visit their grandparents. Flown back to our family after a long deployment. Honeymooned on tropical beaches. We've even been known to take a vacation from time to time. After all that jet setting, nothing feels better than coming home to a warm welcome. At Norfolk International I mean, Airport, look at that. we're proud to be your partners in business it's, and in life. That's why we work so hard people. to make it quick yeah, and we easy already for you to connect with the people, places, but we and things that matter most. We've improved our terminals the pizza and that we to went, we went to pizza faster, we ate created more dining and retail pizza, options to help ate, you feel cheese more cheese mostly cheese cheese and cheese 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 so I think I deserve some cookie. Yep, mommy. No, no, there's no more. Mommy, we're gonna get the help anyway. Did I just say that we're doing that later? Did I say that? I'm so I got the items already. I'm telling you, y'all go to bounce house and I'm gonna take me a nap right in the little corner. I'm gonna sit right in that couch with my blanket and my um. Yeah. A blanket and my pillow, and I'm gonna take me a nice nap. When we play. While y'all play. Mommy, if I'm tired, can I see Are you guys on spring break? No, not yet. Next week, I gotta take a big test. It's math, benchmark. Then after that, I'm on spring break. What? I mean, on spring break, but it already passed spring. We're in summer. Jeanette, yeah, Marvel's Daredevil season two is now on. Today is summer. Today is summer. Today is the winter, spring, summer, fall. Today is summer. Last time, it, yesterday, it, last time, it Ooh. was. Hey, guys. Yes. It's oh. You see how much land this has, y'all? Look at all this I, land. Um, I bought two. I bought two brand new wigs, guys, that I would need to show you guys. 
um, and they're pretty. I got they're them. They're synthetic hair. They're actually um, they're Futura fiber. Futura fiber means that um, you can't go over um, a certain means that they're Futura fiber means that it is synthetic hair, which you can curl, and you can't go over 400 um degrees um That's Fahrenheit on it or something like that. Um, and Futura fiber wigs are the kinds of synthetic wigs that I buy. But for me, I never curl them. What I like to do is I like to put um, perm rods on. You can put like perm rods. You can put like rollers on them and stuff like that. Wet them and then put them like in front of a window where the sun is going to hit it. And then you let it sit there for it to air dry. And your wigs will curl, I promise you. You don't have to use a curling iron. But that's only if you have patience. If you have patience, you can do that. But if, as if you think about as far as like longevity purposes for your wigs... Especially for synthetic wig, honey, that you want to last a very, very long time. I always guarantee, I always ask that you put um, huh, rollers cool. in them and do it that way. Because your, your wigs will go a very, very long way. So, um, hey guys, um, we're going to end this broadcast. Once I get home and we get all these, I want to take like a little, yeah, I want to take like a little 20 minute nap real quick. Because I feel tired. I'm tired. That, I got the itis from that food. I'm going to print out the shipping labels real quick and I'm going to have Josiah get the packages together for me, prep them for me. While I give me a little 20 minute, Hello. Um, a little 20 minute nap. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you. And then drop them off at the post office and then go to Josiah's appointment. And then, you know, me, take one. them to um, Bounce House so that they can have their fun. Or I'm gonna, we're going to go to Newport News first and then so I can go to Costco's. Because I need to get those mats. I have to get those mats. No, if ends, no buts. I need to get those today. Because I want to work on my garage and I would like to get my floors done as soon as possible. As soon? As soon as possible. So, um, yeah. Yeah. So, Mommy. my phone. I'll talk to you guys. Um, you have to slide down. I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Y'all see me Y'all see me a little bit. I just need to take me a little nap real quick or whatever. Because I'm tired. I feel sleepy. I can't function without no nap. So, Not at all, yeah. Yeah, I can't function without nap. And thank you for the hearts. Keep thank the hearts you, coming. Thank you, everybody. I'll see you guys later. I see you later, yo. Bye, everybody. Bye. I, guys, I'm start, also, I'm starting my own broadcast. So make sure y'all come in my room. It's going to say Batman Arkham Knight Reactions.